Hello everyone. Today I'm going to solve one questions related to groundwater problems. So here I have taken one question. You can see a 30 centimeter diameter well completely penetrates as unconfined. Okay, the condition is unconfined aquifer of saturated depth 40 meter. So after a long period of pumping at a steady rate, 1500 liter per minute, the drawdowns in two observations wells 25 meter and 75 from the pumping well were found to be 3.5 meter and 2.0 uh, respectively and here we have to find out the calculate the transmissibility of the aquifer and the find the drawdown of the uh, pumping well so let me start with uh, calculate the the transmissibility so i just what i will do i will write down all the informations that already given in this uh, question so i can see the first things i have rw okay here i have the rw the first things i will take from here which is q sorry q equal 1500 liter per minute so i am going to convert into meter cube per second so i will get 0 0.025 then i have here h so h is 40 centimeter sorry 40 meter and then i have the drawdowns in two observation wells 25 meters and 75 meter so that's mean this is my r1 and r2 so this is r1 25 meter r2 equal 75 meter and then i have pumping well were found to be 3.5 meter so that's mean this will be my s1 so s1 will be 3.5 s2 will be 2.0 then i will i now i have to find out the transmissibility all right so for this one this is the unconfined aquifer so we have to apply the different formula and the formula is q equal pi k h2 square minus h1 square divided ln r2 divided r1 all right so i have my q q already i got it 0 0.025 then pi i don't know the value for the k i will find out this k by using this formula so i have this h2 okay how i will get the h2 i will get the h2 from this formula h2 equal the length h minus s1 and h1 equal okay h2 sorry and h minus s1 so my h is 40 so if i subtract s2 value 2 so i will get 38 so i will get 38 for h2 so i will write 38 square and for the h1 my h value is 40 i subtract s1 value 3.5 from here okay then i will get 36.5 so 36.5 i have to square divide it long r2 i have this r2 75 divided 25 my r1 if i calculate i will get my k my k will be 7.5 eight two three times ten power negative five and my k permeability will be in meter per second once i get the k easily i can get the t because i have to multiply only k and b so in this case it will be height so i will put h and k i already got 7.283 times 10 power negative 5 times i have the h h is my 40 meter so if i calculate i will get 3.13 times 10 power negative 3 this is my transmissibility all right so i already find out this transmissibility so now i will go for the second questions 
okay find the drawdown at the pumping well so for find out these questions i will solve through one formula that we already know for drawdown q equal pi k h1 square minus h w square divided ln r1 divided r w okay so from this formula i will get pi i have this k already i find out from the previous solutions 7.23 10.5 times okay if i have the h1 i know that my h1 is 3.5 square minus i don't know my h w square because this is my drawdown okay divided ln i know the r1 so my r1 is 25 and rw 1.5 because how i get because 35 centimeter diameter so from there i can get my rw so this is the way to get rw equal d by 2 so my d is 30 divided by 2 so 15 meet centimeter so i have to make it meter so 1.0.115 meter so if i calculate here so i will get hw square because my q is 0. Point, my q was 0. 0.025 okay 0. 0.025 then i will get 81.80 811.84 hw equal i will square root 8 i will do my square root i will do a square root for this solution 811.84 i will get 28.49 this is not my hw okay so i have to find out the hw sw okay so this is the formula is h2 minus hw so my h2 was 40 right and i got the hw is 28.49 if i subtract i will get the sw will be 11.51 meter so this is my drawdown at the pumping well drawdown at the pumping well thank you so much